Hi, I'm, I'm Lee Hasselbach. I'm the Chair of Civil and Environmental Engineering here at Lamar University. Oh, coming to Lamar University, first of all, the College of Engineering here is ranked about fifth in the country for rate of investment on, on the tuition you pay and then the job opportunities you have afterwards. And the graduates are very well respected in diverse careers. Lamar is also positioned in a region of the country that's known for its petrochemical industry, for the ports that are here, in addition to its amazing natural resources like the wetlands and the birding trails. And of course, we have concerns and environmental issues such as Hurricane Harvey. So the environmental engineering and the environmental studies programs at Lamar University are hosted here in uh, the Civil and Environmental Engineering Department at Lamar, but they welcome all engineers and all scientists. They are 30 credit hours. It's an accelerated program that you could complete in uh, 12 to 15 months. And those who are Lamar grads also have a four plus one option. You either have a thesis option or the coursework work option. And it has a focus where you, you choose five or more environmental courses and then add on other courses of interest for you. For instance, if you're a mechanical engineer, you may want to take some energy courses. If you're a chemical engineer, you may want to take some more petrochemical courses in addition to the environmental. If you're a biologist, you might want to take ecology or microbiology. If you're a civil engineer, maybe you want to take more water courses. We welcome all engineers and all scientists into the program here. And even the scientists could earn the environmental engineering degree if they wish, if they complete some deficiencies. So you might be interested in, in the cost that this would incur for school. Since it's a 30 hour course, uh, coursework or 30 credit hour program, it, it, it's competitive with other schools, but we also have some scholarships or assistance and assistantships available for qualified full-time students. Please apply early to be considered for them. We're very excited about the combination of accelerated program with some funding available. Oh, the job prospects in the environmental field are very exciting. Um, the Bureau of Labor Statistics is projecting an 8% increase in environmental engineering jobs over this next decade in the country. And regionally, there's many opportunities in, in industry, in consulting, in working for the government, for the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, etc., in the field of environmental studies and engineering. So you might be interested in the research and the lab facilities that we have here at Lamar um, in the environmental arena. Uh, we're pretty excited. We have a Center for Advances in Water and Air Quality associated with the department. The department also has a separate building, which is the hydraulics and, and geotechnical lab, and then a structural material lab. And most of the, most of the research that's done is a, a combination of environmental sustainability material stuff such as beneficial uses of dredge materials or permeable pavements for uh, reduced flooding impacts or, for instance, beneficial uses of waste from the corn ethanol industry. Uh, it's a very diverse but exciting opportunities and the professors and the lecturers take this applied knowledge and bring it into the classroom.